hello once again this is Masai52 with your brand new Skyrim walkthrough I'm a couple of days late I know because I've had a lot of stuff to do e.g. I've been working yay today we'll finish the rest of Bleak Falls Barrow I'm gonna try looking at my laptop the whole time so you can hear my voice properly had a few people moan about oh I can't hear your voice oh look at this oh you sound really quiet and I'm like oh for God's sake just shut up I'll just take everything out of them as I said I'm only gonna take stuff from crates I can't be bothered to loot bodies it's not really gonna take it's not really gonna get me anything decent is it I'm not really looking for swords. But down here, if you go down here, I only noticed this like the third time I did it. You get a, uh, there's a crate down here. Pretty, pretty simple novice really. Oh, second time of doing that one. That's getting a bit better. Just might as well take both of them potions that I can sell later. Well, yeah, the potions and the money. We're, we're ending near Bleak Falls Barrow, so this may be a short episode depending on how long I spend oh, doing this. Oh, shit. Oh, we're coming up to the area where... Oh, I'm running back on myself. That's stupid. Well, we're coming back to, like... Uh, we're coming up to where we'd fight the relentless druid of... Yeah, we're fighting the relentless guy here, you know. Relentless! Oh yeah. Oh, there he is. Get as many slices in as possible. No. Kneecap face! Uh, he, he's got money on him, but nothing else really important. There we go, third time lucky. <laughs> Take the amethyst and the gold and other than that, I don't really need anything else. Cool screen uploading. Why do you take so long? Uh. running around in my cool armor oh. I hate this bullshit later on you will get something that will help you with this so, like a it's a shout it's like well I think it's called well, uh, well wind camp. Pretty useful. I use it a lot when I do all these druids' caves and shit like that. I'm just gonna rush it all through so you know how to do it and all that. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna just quickly. I think I need stamina. Oh, we're up to the last bit. This is the bit where you put the actual key in the door. Um, I'm pretty sure the pattern itself is I'll, uh, ow. Um, I think this is it. I'm not even sure. May not be. Nope, it's the other way around. It's... Bear Moth Bird. That's how I remember it. Bear Moth Bird. Bear Moth Bird. Then you put the Dragon Claw in and boom! Opens it all up. 
Look at that pretty door, and it's nice now. Running boo. We've got a lot of time in this episode, so we might as well spend about a minute or two just looking around, seeing if there's anything we can find. I thought this would have taken me just a tad longer. <coughs> Oh, got a cough on me. No, uh, actually, walking around boring. Let's just get to the main bit. What will happen is you can like you can search all these stuff here, but as you can hear, it's the Doverkin song in the background, which means there's a. This is where the enemy you have to kill is right here. He's surrounded here. But he doesn't do anything until you learn the word. One Eden. Out this. This is where you learn your first power word. It's Voos or Voss, which is um, part of the Voss Rodar, which means force. And here's where our enemy comes out. Give him a quick sneak attack. Die, demon! Oh. oh! See, look. If I would have used the one handed sword, that, that would have gone so slow. Okay, the dragon stone. Let's just put that to last. We'll take the enchanted stuff. The dragon stone is part of the main quest which we will be doing probably next episode because I'll spend the rest of this episode probably I'll probably just quickly go towards Riverwood and finish the quest and all that and then I'll stop it before I do the next episode so oh, take Dragonstone and make our way back oh. There's no point running the whole way through, like... The, there's no way run... That, there's no point running all the way back. You just like, when you can run up the stairs and go through the hidden passage. Each ruins will have a hidden passage. So the best thing to do is just to try and find that hidden passage. You never know, there's hidden passages that are halfway through which can help you like skip all the boring stuff guess that's a way of putting it skipping all the stuff you don't really need like let's say loads of enemies oh my god that katana looks so cool I want it you imagine me running around for katana Masak 52 the ninja warrior alright just for a little heads up when you come out here there is a potion on the floor it's, pro it's usually the enchanters potion which it just gives you extra like bonus when enchanting I'm just gonna fall down here to save a hell of a lot of time, I'm just gonna just I'm just gonna do this. Yep. Whenever you've been to a village, you can just fast travel to it. Simple as. No no questions asked, sort of thing. It's not a lot of hassle, I guess, but running just takes a hell of a lot more time, and you know it's time that you could spend recording, which I'm gonna like try to do for you. Oh, it has to be night when I turn up, doesn't it? Right, well, it's only what, 1am so... All shops open at 8 by the way, so I'll just wait 8 hours. I know that's 9 o'clock, but you know, it's better than nothing. It's not like I want to spend the rest of my day. Oh. Huh. 
want to give a special shout out to Denden51 while I'm here. He is actually playing Skyrim himself. Hasn't got very far, but and he, I think he's also refusing to use my walkthroughs. Show those thieves not to steal from Luke and Valerius. Let's give him this golden claw. You found it! <laughs> there it is! Strange. It seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? It's because it shrunk. I'm this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. Thank you. Thanks for the extra money. Now, the good thing about this is... It means so much to us to have the claw back where it belongs. Thank you. Excuse me, shut the fuck up. I'm trying to talk. The good thing is you can take this sword and this gold that's over here. You can't take the iron helmet. Lucky for you, that was just sitting there for the taking. But there's other stuff that you can take that he's just like all this you can just take and he's all like, Ah oh, well thank it's you. A fine day with you around. Oh hello, baby. Wanna flirt some more? It's not much good stuff, but you know, anything You're worth selling and all that. Here. That makes two of us. Now, heh, might as well finish it off here. I have been your host, Masaik52, and I hope you're enjoying the series. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.